This six-year-old boy got bullied for how his ears looked, and so his parents agreed to a plastic surgery. Nice fam. By the end of this video, we will show you how he looks after the surgery. But before we even go there, let me ask you this controversial but important question. Is it okay for children to get plastic surgery? Take the case of Nadia, who as early as 10 years old already wanted a plastic surgery. Because of her ears, her classmates would mock her, calling her names like Dumbo. And that is why at the age of 14, Nadia finally got her wish. Thanks to a non-profit that offered free plastic surgery for bullied kids, she was even flown to New York to have her ears pinned back. This will be our target ear, so that I'll match it up, to, I'll match the other ear, which is not as lateralized as this ear. But this is where it gets interesting, because guess what happened when the doctor examined her? Turns out, even if Nadia herself only requested to adjust her ears, the surgeon went on to suggest more changes. I love thin chins, but I don't want them as pointy as that chin. We talked about that, didn't we? Mm -hmm. We looked at some pictures. If this is what you say to a 14-year-old who already struggles with self-esteem, are you not teaching kids they are not enough the way they are? It's gonna be nervous at first, but I think I can pull it through and that they'll realize that what they have done and they'll stop. And here is where it gets interesting, because what stops these kids from adding one more and then one more change? What stops them from being addicted to surgeries? I mean, I know this is an extreme, but do you remember this girl who paid to fix her body over 100 times? She too started at a young age of 13. She too risked her own health for the sake of beauty. And she too decided to do all of this because she got bullied. What makes it even more dangerous is that not every young person who goes under the knife gets out of the operation alive. Such tragic fate fell on 18-year-old Emmeline, who underwent a surgery to get a bigger chest. After she was given anesthesia, Emmeline went into cardiac arrest. She began turning blue, but reportedly did not get help for about five long hours. Afterwards, this young girl went into a coma and suffered severe brain damage. And just 14 months after the plastic surgery, she passed away. All because of our beauty standards. I have a lot to say about this. But before I share with you my thoughts, let's go back to our first story. So remember the six-year-old kid who dreaded going to school because he was mocked for his ears? That I look like an elf and, and that I have weird ears. Well, after only two hours surgery, the kid now looks like this. Here we go. Oh my gosh. I mean, let's be honest, looking at this kid's smile and just seeing how happy he is, I can't help but empathize with parents who think plastic surgery for their kid is okay. Because who wouldn't want to save their child from the shame and bullying, right? But then again, wouldn't giving in to the belief that you have to change yourself just to feel worthy and loved only prove the bullies right? When is a plastic surgery for a child truly about empowering them to live a better life? And when is the surgery only creating more self-esteem problems? Night fam. This topic is more complicated and personal than it seems. So, for the last time, let me leave you with the question. Is it okay for children to get plastic surgery?